Welcome to Chaos and Cryptography. In this video, we'll see how to generate secret key using a Henon map for an encryption process. I'm extending the program that we saw in the previous video. So I kindly request you to watch the previous video before coming to this video. I'm generating two sets of values, one for the confusion process and the other for the diffusion process. K1 is used to confuse a row with say nine elements. Hence, it must consist of values in the range zero to eight. Therefore, we have mod row that is mod nine. Then comes K2. It is used for the diffusion process. The pixel intensity of an image is in the range zero to 255. Hence, we have mod 256 to produce the values in this range. Let's see the output. Here we see two sets of values. The first set is in the range 0 to 8, which is used for the confusion process. And the second set is in the range 0 to 255, which is used for the diffusion process. Please note the following. The initial conditions are called the secret keys. In this case, there are four keys that is 0 0.01, 0 0.2, 1.4, and 0 0.3. You can convert to binary form if your system requires it. These are the keys which must be used at both the encryption and decryption end of a symmetric encryption process. The second point to be noted is that. The equation used for generating K1 and K2 are user defined. It can be optimized to suit your own requirement. And thirdly, the design of using and generating keys for any encryption process is very innovative and can be done to suit your own needs. Thank you for watching. Stay tuned for more videos on chaos and cryptography.